Welcome. This is the energy vibration reading for Aaliyah's. Leah's. Oh my God, Aaliyah's. Finally, Aaliyah's. Oh, I had to get to you guys. Aaliyah's. This is a month of an air energy. It is a month of April. And you have to be aware of the situation that is going on around you, Leos, in this month because it is a month where you are going to be balancing out some karmatic situations in your life. And this year is really a year of karmas that is ending off uh, um, karmatic situations, which is good because um, you it's going to affect all the signs, just about everyone is going to be affected. Okay, so. Um, don't be um, taken back whenever these situations are happening because obviously um, you need to um, clear whatever karmatic situation that you're dealing with in all this. Listen to your intuition, okay? I am seeing that you Leos are going to be taking down your enemies. That is very good. This month has four weeks. Please like and share this video if this is your first time to the channel. I'm sorry about the quality, but I can't do anything. It's the message that is coming through. So let's see what is coming up for you in this month of April 2019. You have your own energy vibration in the first week. This is good. This is positive. It is the energy of you moving forward in your life in a very positive way. Things are happening for you, Leo. So this is wonderful. Okay. Wonderful energies, Julius. Then you have the energy of some secrets are going to be coming out. Secrets that you weren't aware of is going to be coming out. You're going to be finding out a lot of stuff. Then the energy of the star is here, and it's as if your spirit guides are going to be working with you in the third week. So the fourth week, in the fourth week, you're going to be tearing away. Um, you're you're tearing down a negative situation where. There was some deceptiveness that was happening, and you found out, and you're you're breaking this deceptive situation down, and you're moving um, people and situation out of your life. You're seeing things for what they are, and you are definitely working and removing these situation out of your life, which is very good. So as I look at the four weeks, first you have a fire energy, so the first week is going to be good for you. Then you have water energy in the second week. In the third week, you have hair. It's the energy of, of the month dealing with a scorpion or a cancer. Or it is uh, that this is that you definitely are on the move. You're moving towards positive things in your life. The eye princess is here guiding you on your part to release these things from your life. So we're calling upon the angels and guides of the Leas to come out show us what is happening well, some of you you could be deciding to change your car your vehicle and your spirit be good because a lot of you are going to be receiving some fortunate fortunate situations that is transpiring some real fortunate situations that is transpiring then we have the energy of uh, the queen of cups now whoever this person is uh, um, you're going to be finding out something about a Pisces cancer or a scorpion lady. Okay, this is coming up as a mother figure for some of you, but some of you, it could be your child's mother that you're dealing with a situation with. Some of you, this person could be coming up where they're affecting your life and um, you're going to be finding out that they have been doing something distasteful to you. Now, um, the energy of uh, money is going to be coming in. The wheel of fortune is going to be bringing you guys this money. And it is for, uh, because of something that uh, Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion has done. Some of you in the second week, listen to your intuition about the Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. This person is between the ages of 18 and 45. And some of you in the second week, um, you're going to be moving forward. Uh, money is going to be coming in slowly but surely in your life. The third week, um, there is going to be some good news coming in for you, Leos. In the third week, whatever the situation is or was, the Wheel of Fortune is going to be bringing you some good news. The energy of the star and the Wheel of Fortune is very fortunate for you, and the outcomes is that you ladies, ladies, um, five years and older, you could be having a situation with. Um, 
uh, your, your, your teenage or young adult child. So as we notice, there is going to be some help if you're looking for a, a car, there is going to be some financial help that is going to be coming at you. The energy of the Queen of Wands, she is here, she's standing, she's waiting. Um, outcomes and the effect of this month is that the older people, the older people, the effect of this month is that it's going to affect you or you people 45 years and older. So you leave us 45 years and older. There is definitely an effect that is going to be transferring. As we look at the second week, the second week is that there is something unexpectedly news about money. It could be um, that money is coming to you. Definitely it's coming, but it's coming uh, slowly but surely. Um, some of you ladies uh, um, 45 years and older are worried, but it's going to be coming through for you. The energy of the star is your angels and guides uh, is coming in, um, but there is definitely some good news that is going to be coming in. Some of you could be receiving some good news um, about um, your intuition and guides is going to be guiding you. Because whenever the wheel of fortune comes in with the six of wands, it's going to be happening for you. The center of this month of the wheel of fortune is a very, very positive energy because what had happened at the transfer is that um, fortune is on your side. Fortune is definitely on your side. So if you are going through legal issues and that sort of a thing, you leave fortune is on your side. As we look at the situation with the chariot and the page of pentacles and eye princess in the month of april for the leos you are especially the women four five years and older or women on a whole there is definitely going to be some transition you guys could be moving um, um or um having help we're going to be receiving help with a, a, a car situation there is definitely stability that is going to be coming in in the second week going in the third week there's definitely stability that is going to be coming in and um with this stability is that your angels and guides are definitely going to be showing you and helping you guys with the pisces cancer or scorpion people and you're going to be finding out that they could be scorpions and and and, and cancer you're going to be finding out that um some luck you're going to be receiving some luck it's as if through something that they have done it's going to bring you really luck in your life. We have the energy of the Page of Pentacles, the Knight of Pentacles. What is transpiring here is that some of you have to deal with um, these people between the age of 18 and 45, they're Taurus, Leo, or Sagittarius. Now, the situation is that it could be a child. If they're coming up as kids, whatever the situation is, is that they're coming up as kids. And you ladies are going to have to work out the situation. It's a karmatic situation between you and your child that needs to be worked out. And this situation is definitely going to be balancing out, okay? Um, whatever the conflicts were between you and a, a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion, it is going to now come to an end with your kids. So the outcome is that you women, 45 years and older, there could be someone who is definitely looking out for you okay it's going to be coming in your life and there is going to be some luck karmatic situation because kids are coming up so there is a lot of karmatic issues and situation with your child mother with your kids mother and that sort of a situation that is going to be transpiring so you men um expect that this month um situation with kids and uh, it's going to be coming up there's going to be some conflicts and that sort of a thing but as you come to the end of the month whatever that is happening some luck is going to be very lucky someone who is in this world but it could be an earth angel it could be someone who really likes you and care about you that is looking out for you and it's going to be helping you so ladies and gentlemen it is really not a bad month this reading um takes another half an hour so you can connect via um via uh on demand uh if you'd like to see the extended of this reading the next two energies that we have for you guys energy one and energy two 
Um, if you choose card one and card two, you have to choose one of these cards, whatever the situation is. I need to come back to the energies because there is something that very that is very important who have kids, and this could be also affecting people who are in conflicts. Okay, so you ladies is going to be a positive month. If you you can use the energy of the mouse in and yes, because it's that and it's an animal spirit guide. Um, light workers have the energy of the unicorns or the fire dragons, but um, other people have the energy of the mouse and of the animals, and they are saying to um, tend to the small things. The people who and this is number four, so the angels and guides are going to be helping you and watching over you. The people who choose number one, number two is the energy of the lizard spirit, and that's what I said, the fire dragons and that sort of thing. And what is transpiring here is a good positive energy because. Definitely, there's going to be some surprises coming out. So, if you dream of something that you always will and want, you're going to be realizing that you're going to bring it in your life. And this is going to be good. So, that's really positive. As we look at the activation card for you guys in this month, uh, I tell you, there is the same sort of energy. You have tragic journey, another double energy that comes up. So, some of you. I've been going through a situation and keep on going and ask your angels and guides to protect you as you take this time to go through this journey. Ladies and gentlemen, I want to say to you, thank you for being here. Please like, share these videos, thumbs up, um, check out the on demand, and I will say namaste until next time.